So I'd like to imagine that what we have here is a unit of positive charge. Now, if we uh, have this electric uh, field here where we've got basically zero volts and a positive plate, this positive charge is gonna be repelled from the positive plate and it's gonna go down to, uh, as low as it can down to that uh, the lowest plate with the lowest potential. Now, in order to move it up, what I have to do is I have to do a work on this over a certain distance because it doesn't want to be moving this way. As soon as I take my finger away, it's gonna move back down to where it was before. And what we can look at is the amount of work that I do per unit charge to move this in this electric field. So I do a certain amount of work W moving this uh, positive charge, which has uh, some kind of charge Q. Remember Q being the fact that it's quantized and it's made up of this elementary charge or little e and some multiple of that. And if I move it um, up through a certain distance, it will increase its electrical potential and V is gonna be equal to the potential difference. And the important thing to notice is that potential difference has a symbol V and potential difference also has the units V as well. Now it follows from this that the greater uh, the charge or the greater the potential difference I need to move it through, the greater the amount of energy that I need to put into this to actually move it up there. And therefore it follows that the, the work done is equal to the charge times the potential difference. Now we could also look at this in another way. We could say that the potential difference is equal to the work or the energy per unit charge. And this is uh, following on from the last video that I did all about EMF versus potential difference. And it's this equation here that really gives us the definition for the volt, okay? So one volt is the potential difference between two points when one joule of work is done to move a charge of one coulomb. The description down here, I've just put a full uh, definition of what one volt is and how this is related to potential difference. And this equation here, that W is equal to QV. The work done is equal to the charge multiplied by the potential difference.